Today we're making chili. We got one pound of lean ground beef and one pound of venison. And what we're going to do, we're going to add one medium onion chopped up, and about a half a green pepper chopped up. And we got one stalk of celery chopped up. I'm going to put this on the stove, I'm going to brown it. Okay, got all nice and brown, venison the hamburg there. Now we're going to add to this one tablespoon of chili powder, two beef bouillon cubes, one teaspoon of dried oregano, one teaspoon of paprika, one half teaspoon of dried basil, one teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of brown sugar, one teaspoon of ancho chili pepper, and one half teaspoon of black pepper. Okay, to this we're going to add one 29 ounce can of tomato sauce. Nice sound effects. And two 15 and a half ounce cans of diced tomatoes. One and a two. And then one 15 ounce can of dark red kidney beans rinsed and drained and one 15 and a half ounce can of great northern beans rinsed and drained. We're going to give that a big stir. Now we've got a 64 ounce jar of tomato juice and how much we put in is entirely up to you. This is how liquid or thick your chili is going to be. So you can use none of it, or all of it, or somewhere in between. And you can see, right about here is a good consistency, it's consistency I like for me. But, uh, again, it's entirely up to you. Okay, we're going to stove this. <laughs> Cook on the stove. Um, about a half hour, 45 minutes, let it simmer, get all the flavors mixed in together. And as far as the tomato juice, I use about half of that. So about 30, 32 ounces in this, but you can add more or less, up to you. So there you have it. Got some venison chili with some cornbread and muffins.